Good morning from Dubai News. This is Shaima Gore. Our top stories for the hour. Saudi and Russia were in hostility for decades, but now the two superpowers have decided to deepen their ties. A new immigration system is out at the Dubai airports. This innovation is a collaboration of Emirates Identity Authority and Dubai airports. Spain has taken direct control of Catalonia and stacked the region's government. The move came after the Catalonian president passed a declaration of independence on the 27th of October 2017. Football fans should focus to UAE for the next few days as the 14th edition of the FIFA Football Club is going to take place in Alain and Abu Dhabi. Saudi and Russia were in hostility for decades, but now the two superpowers have decided to deepen their ties. King Salman of Saudi was at Moscow to sign a billion-dollar deal in energy investments. It is the first official visit of a Saudi monarch to Russia. The two countries decide of having a trade of oil and armed weapons. Your Majesty, we are very happy to greet you here. I am convinced that your visit will give a tremendous boost to the ties between our states. A new immigration system is out at the Dubai airports. This innovation is a collaboration of Emirates Identity Authority and Dubai airports. Now all residents of the UAE can enter without queuing up at the immigration stand. As smart gates are open to all, protocol has become easier and convenient for passengers. The new immigration process that we've been rolling out is um, utilizing the smart gates that we have across the airport. Now, these smart gates historically have been used by um, passengers with specific identity cards or specific types of passports. Well, we've changed that now, and now um, everybody who's a resident of the UAE who has an Emirates ID card can use those gates. Spain has taken direct control of Catalonia and stacked the region's government. The move came after the Catalonian president passed a declaration of independence on the 27th of October 2017. Prime Minister Mariano Rajoy now replaces Catalan president Carles as the top decision maker in the region. Catalan separatists have turned to Europe for support, but most European Union leaders have sided with the central government. They have made it clear that an independent Catalonia would have to apply for EU membership, a process that would take years. And while the fight on Catalan independence will eventually be settled, it may take a long time for Catalonia and Spain to return to peaceful coexistence. Football fans should focus to UAE for the next few days as the 14th edition of the FIFA Football Club is going to take place in Alain and Abu Dhabi. The buzz around the tournament is about defending champions Real Madrid. There will be eight matches in total as the tournament returns to the UAE for the third time. December is a, is a month where we have a very beautiful weather. Teams coming from all over the, the world. Thanks for watching Dubai News. Stay tuned for more updates.